tipsy cause I've been sipping on Henny. I got the study of my vision and she ain't from the city. And she ain't foreign and she boring. Love the way you twerk it, shawty. Throwing money on her own, I call it independent, shawty. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Evil Rabbit here on Forza Motorsport 7, staring down that beautiful M4 drift build that I did, bringing back a retro paint scheme from Horizon 3 with the EVLs all over it. NRG Innovation sponsored. Big shout out to NRG Innovations for supporting me and supporting the channel. We are rocking the 350 millimeter NRG Innovations mint green and white now. Uh, full size wheel in our energy innovations bucket seat. So big shout out to energy innovations for hooking me up with that stuff and, you know, giving me some amazing products to use when I am in the middle of doing this and getting sideways. So we are here today to do something with that M4. We're going to be doing some rival drift events, trying to see how high we can get up in the rivals for drifting. Uh, haven't done the rivals much, so we're going to get into drifting with this M4 since uh, I was pretty comfortable with it when I built it. But before we do that, it is day 23 of the 25 Days of Christmas giveaways. Christmas is right around the corner. So if you guys haven't finished your shopping and everything, hope you guys did. Uh, I just finished mine uh, actually yesterday. So it was uh, definitely good to find everything I needed. So today is 20 day 23 of the poster giveaways. And today's poster that we are giving away is that of that Falcon Tires S14 autographed poster of Odie Bakshis. Definitely a nasty driver, amazing car, love his S14, uh, can't wait to see what he's going to be doing next season. So if you guys want a chance to win that autographed Odie Bakshi's poster, make sure you comment in, down in the comment section down below as well as like and subscribe. I do appreciate all the support. Uh, I wish I could change M modes, but I'm not going to need to because that car is going to be M. Anyways, so let's get into some rivals here. We are going to go to um, track day, no, drift zones. So... It looks like we are going to be drifting at, e I guess we'll go Maple Valley. Um, so our first person we got to beat at Maple Valley is 31,000 points. I think that's very doable in this M4. Oh, it's not going to let me use the M4. You, oh, get wrecked. Is this going to let me use the M4? Nope. I don't think any of these are going to let me use my M4. Ah, uh, definitely sad now. We were staring at that beautiful M4. Is this one gonna let me use the M4? Nope. Why not? Ah, uh, get wrecked. What about this one? Can we use it M4 on this one? Probably not. No. Okay, so... Well, that's kind of uh, disappointing. So we're still going to get into the Rivals events, but apparently we can only use our Forza Edition BMW or our Skyline. Um, so I guess we're going to throw the Skyline in the mix. Automatically enter the... No, oh, it's going to change my parts. How high off am I? All right, I guess we'll use this BMW. We see if we can't beat this rival event. Kind of upset that I can't use my M4. Maybe we'll hop into an online session with that M4 and see what we do in a pack. But I want to try beating one of these rival events. I don't know how this uh, Forza Edition, you know, E36 is going to handle. But we're going to find out here. You know, we're just going to throw it into it. Hopefully, uh, play didn't. It's got a paint on it, so obviously I must have tuned it. So we're about to find out because I don't know how it's going to work. <laughs> so we're about to find out here. In this rival event, Maple Valley. Got the full wheel setup going. All right, let's do it. Hopefully we can beat 31,000 points, which I feel is very doable because normally I'm at, you know, 15, 60,000 point runs, but it's with my tune cars. Oh, it's re reversed too. Okay, so this may not be as easy as I thought. So we're about to find out. Oh, this car is definitely underpowered. I don't know if this is going to work. Oh, and it's a different version. All right, so we're throwing ourselves into a rail event that we have absolutely no practice in. In a car that's not well-tuned. So, get wrecked. With the idea that I wanted to, can't do. I was hoping to use that M4, but 
apparently uh, in Rivals you have to use similar cars to what they were using. Yeah, this M this uh, this does not drive that well. We gotta somewhat save this. We may have to do another run at this because I don't want to not be able to beat this, but this car is not handling at all how I need it to. It gets a little better. There we go. There's no power compared to what I'm used to. Ah! We're nowhere near 31,000. And I think we're pretty much almost done, too. Oh, boy. I don't know if we're going to be able to, but we'll try it for sure. So I hope you guys are excited for the holiday season with family, friends, however you guys celebrate the holidays. I'm excited to spend the holidays with my family. Oh, boy. Oh, we flipped our car. I would not be spending holidays with my family if this was actually what happened. So, we're definitely gonna have to try this one more time. Cause I don't even think this car has the power to do this sweeper, which is probably where most of the points are gonna be had to be had. Nope. I mean, I feel like if we didn't flip, we should be able to have this 31,000 target score. So we're going to try this. We're going to have as much speed as we can through this right now. Second lap's the charm, right? Oh, that's not going to help. It's 2,400 points out the drain already. Oh, this is, uh, this is bad. So rivals, not as easy as I thought it was going to be because I can't use the car I want to use. So... And I didn't want to, I guess I could go and tune this car and make this car handle very well, but I think this gives it a little bit of a challenge that I'm apparently not up for right now. Because, uh, dude's walking all over me with the points. I wonder how many laps it took him to get that. I'm not going to let him beat me. Oh my god! Apparently we may All right, so we're going to restart and uh, We're gonna try it again. I Hit continue. I should just kind of restart because I can't I can't go out on a losing note. I can't do it. It's not gonna happen Don't want to go out on a losing note We're gonna have to retry this I can't believe that we're gonna have to just bump the tire pressures. We're gonna have to change it. Maybe when we get to a higher class, we'll change our cars, maybe? I don't know. All right, we're gonna have to use this, but we're gonna have to bump that tire pressure up. To get some more uh, higher spin up in here. Bumped up to, yeah, we'll go 35. Bump it up to 35. There we go. All right, we're going for gold this time. We're going for the win. I hope, uh, hope we're able to get it actually, because uh, it's pretty sad right now. I was hoping to use the uh, M4, but uh, we may have to uh, just cut our losses and use the M4 in another episode. So if you guys want to see that M4 drift more, let me know down in the comment section down below. Let me give us another shot. Trying not to destroy our car. I Man's definitely got much more of a run, but I think we'll be able to do this. Feel that tire pressure change? I think we might be okay, but I don't know. This car's so sketchy right now. It's pretty much not even tuned. Stock, like, suspension probably. I think this is stock off the winning tier. It's a little better. There we go. 
All right, okay, getting the feel of it now. No, did not want to do that. I should have stayed wider. I thought I could sweep that whole thing, but I started in, but the tire pressure change actually helped. I don't see why we should not be able to beat this 31,000 score because that's a very low score than what I'm used to driving here at Maple Valley. But again, I did say that this car is not tuned. There we go. But I guess this just tests my drifting skills, drifting in a car that's not set up specifically how I like it. I don't know how we just saved that, how we saved our points, but we're uh, still, I think, behind the eight ball of our points here. A little flick to get some points there. There we go. All right. We have to get some nasty amount of points to this section. I don't know if it's going to be possible. <laughs> Not doing it that way. Don't flip the car. Don't flip the car. There we go. All right. We got to get the sweeper. We should be able to need 5,000 points in the sweeper, roughly. I think we got it. I think we're good. I hope we don't lose these points. Don't get greedy. Yeah, we got it. We're good. 32. We'll take that. Definitely we'll take that W on that guy. Okay, so. Finish this race up. See if it changes our saying or if it just clears it out and we got to go to another track but uh that was a bit interesting a lot different than what i'm used to so it was kind of fun you know doing something that i'm not used to all right so where are we at now did it change it up So unfortunately, after I did all the Rivals events, I realized that my internet was having issues connecting to the servers. I don't know if it was on my end or the servers on Forza, but I could not connect to a multiplayer session like I wanted to. So I am going to get that sorted out, and I will be back tomorrow with some online drifting in that beautiful M4 that I am so comfortable in. Hopefully I can get some good sessions in and maybe... Uh, take a first place so until tomorrow guys you can follow me on facebook twitch twitter and instagram all of which are found in the description box below i'd like to thank you guys for watching and uh back tomorrow with day 24 the christmas eve giveaway here on the channel we're gonna be ripping that m4 in some online sessions so come back tomorrow if you want to see that m4 ripping through i hope you guys are having a good holiday season so until tomorrow guys thank you guys for watching i'm evil rabbit i'm out I'm loving, I'm tipsy cause I've been sipping on